Foxholes dot a threatening landscape where resources are scarce and power even less so. A major first step in any invasion is the disruption of the power grid. As demand rises and supply dwindles, soldiers had to adapt. Using the knowledge of their supplies, the men devised a creative and ingenious way to craft a radio receiver that will remain in power each time a signal may strike the antenna. Building a foxhole radio involves assembling a few basic components. An antenna, a coil, a capacitor, a diode, and an earpiece. First, the antenna captures radio waves from the air. These waves are then filtered and tuned by the coil and capacitor, which are adjusted to resonate at the desired frequency. The tuned signal is passed through a diode, in this case, our crystal, which rectifies the alternating current signal into direct current. The crystal's chemical makeup being the key to the radio's operability. These direct electrical pulses pass through the crystal and represent the audio information carried by the radio waves traveling through space and captured by the antenna. Finally, the earpiece converts this electrical signal into sound waves. Our radio requires no power because the electricity comes from the electromagnetic radio signals. The messages drive the device, 